God bless you indeed, everybody. John 3, 16 says, For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten Son, that whosoever believeth in him or who believes in him will not perish but have ever to everlasting or eternal life. Can you imagine that God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten Son, that you and I now can become the sons of God? Amen. Hallelujah. Isn't that a wonderful gift? Imagine there, there was a bridge and the bridge was broken and God sent Jesus as the way to get from one side of the bridge to the other side of, of the bridge. So Jesus was sent to repair the bridge so that we can now have a relationship or oh, and to be and we can also be reconciled back to the father through yeshua i'm a shay amen into our god wonderful i just want to say today that if any person if you've been thinking about it or pondering about who jesus is or you've been your heart have been stirred to make Jesus Christ your Lord and Savior. I invite you out of your free will to say this prayer with me. Romans 10, 9. If you believe God raised Jesus Christ from the dead and you confess that Jesus Christ is Lord, you'll be saved. Say after me. Heavenly Father, I believe that you raised Jesus Christ from the dead. Lord Jesus Christ, I invite you into my heart. I accept you as my Lord and Savior. Thank you, Father, for sending Jesus to die for my sins. Thank you. I am saved. And I am written in heaven. Amen. If you just said that prayer, God bless you indeed. And you are you have just embarked on one of or the most beautiful journey ever. Amen. Have you heard the Pringles ad? Once you pop, you can't stop. Amen. The Bible has its version where it says, Oh, taste and see that the Lord is good. And I encourage you to taste and see how good Yeshua Hamashiach really is. He loves us and he loves you dearly. Love matters, amen? Because all of us as mankind, we are searching for something, but who we are really searching for is Jesus and God is love, amen? So we're actually searching for love. Sure.